All right, so today we're going to be going shopping at Ross. Every time I go here, it's like a treasure hunt. You never know what you're going to find, but you know I am balling on a budget. So let's go find something for the low low. All right, so let's go ahead and check out the watches and jewelry. I saw a lot of gold jewelry and earrings, nothing that really stuck out to me. What really caught my eye was this fossil bracelet here. I've been trying to accessorize a little bit more, switch up my style, do something a little different. And this was very eye grabbing. I love the colors on it. The bracelet was cool, but it was just a bit too expensive for me. The colors are awesome, but $12 is just too out of an ask. I'd rather give my money to a small business, so I had to pass. Colognes, colognes, colognes. Can you go wrong with a fresh scent? Obviously not. I really haven't found the perfect brands to shop for at Ross. I noticed that there's a lot of name brands like Burberry and Polo Ralph Lauren. You can sometimes find things like Sean John as well. It's just that I don't really know what's a good scent to get here. I mean, you can't smell them. They're in boxes. So I'll have to look out for that. I really like Ocha. I've been getting a lot of their scents offline, but I don't know if I'm ready just to buy a scent at Ross without being able to smell it. But got a lot of good options here, so check it out, sneakerheads. Let's make our way to the activewear. Ross has some really nice joggers, Adidas, Nike. You can find a lot of good stuff if you know where to look for it. I found these champion sweats here. They're a nice color, but the big champion on the bottom was very unappealing to me. For a fair price of like $16, it's nice for any champion, but for me, I had to put it back on the rack. And while we're at it, we might as well look at the athletic tops. I usually never find too many good tops in this area. Sometimes you can find like a nice quality workout shirt by Adidas or Nike, but once again, I don't really wear workout tops like casually. If I'm going to the gym or something, I love to rock these, but you see your typical run of the mill sports jerseys, sports hoodies, you know, cheap discounted name brand wear, but once again, nothing really stood out to me. I checked this section mainly to see if I find something that's been misplaced, like a cool graphic tee or a really nice button up, but most of the time, I don't get a lot of luck in this area. All right, so here's where things finally started to take a turn for the better for me. I usually don't check out the denims because they're a dime a dozen to me, but I got rewarded for my curiosity. I wasn't even expecting this, y'all. I found this beautiful pair of Gap pants. They're like a nice red, orange, burgundy, very casual and good for work. I love the fit and the look of these guys. And they're only $14.99. Very fairly priced. I love the tapered look of these pants. I really don't like things that are straight leg. I feel like it makes me look very boxy and wide. But these right here are a perfect essential for any piece of workwear. I'm so happy that I was able to find these, y'all, because I've been looking for something red in like a casual workwear setting. Moving forward, we have the knits. This is a great section to look through if you're looking for more work wear. I love this section because it has things like cardigans, button ups, short sleeve button ups, you name it, they got it. We were also able to find this nice Polo Ralph Lauren sweater. The dark blue color was a vibe, but for $30, I'm going to graciously pass. Ross is nice for cheap clothes. However, they overcharge for the big name brand, so look out for that. We we're also able to find this cool Neff jacket. It looks like something that, you know, a coach would wear. It's very athleisure to me. It has a collar, it's thin, it's like a cool windbreaker, but eh, yellow ain't really my color, so I pass. But I can rock with some pink though, especially if it's by the brand Cactus Man. They make such good quality clothes and they're fairly priced. I love it because their designs are unique and they fit very well on the body. I had to pass on this one though because I already have a short sleeve pink button up. But trust me, Cactus Man, you will be getting my money soon. And stop sleeping on these brands, guys. Cactus Man is something you definitely want to start looking out for. We found this Adidas jacket over here too. I didn't really think too much of it. It's nice if you're looking for that vibe, but I live in Florida, so track jackets aren't really a necessity. We're hot all year round. This is just a winter thing. Yeah, I'll pass. I'm starting to see a lot more packs on that Ross. This is interesting, different, but I'm cool with it. Here's this nice mint green sweater. I didn't really see the potential, how it would look on me, so I put it back, but it's nice to know that PacSun is becoming available elsewhere at department stores. 
great for your wallet. I was feeling a little disappointed because I didn't think I'd find anything else. And then to my surprise, I found this beautiful Gap shirt. It was $7, barely priced. I don't know why I've been so obsessed with Gap lately. Probably because Kanye and his ventures with them, which may end pretty soon. However, Gap is still a very quality brand. If for $7, who could pass up on a shirt like this? Another cop. But that is something I am learning about Ross. It's a treasure hunt at the end of the day. The more you look, the more you will find. And sometimes I'm so fixated on finding one thing that I miss out on a lot of great opportunities. I usually go for graphic tees, but they've been very weak in the graphic tee department lately. I'm not even gonna cap with y'all. I found this cool Dragon Ball Z shirt, but it's just too similar to something I already have. And the design to me is kind of basic, like, that's the thing with Dragon Ball graphic tees, they will print these out like it's water. And sometimes you don't get the most unique and innovative designs, but it was a cool charcoal black. However, I just bought a charcoal black shirt, so pass. All right, so I decided to check out their jogger section once again, and I discovered a beautiful pair of green cargos that I already have. They're by this brand called Ring of Fire, and once y'all start checking them out, they make cheap Good quality joggers, they come in all sorts of colors. You might have seen them in some of my outfit shorts. Definitely recommend you check them out. And yes, Nike heads, Ross caters to you too. I found your dark gray sweats for the ladies, of course, but you know your boy Free don't really rock Nike like that. But these were a great pair of pants, $24. I can see the value in these because you rarely find Nike in Ross. It was fairly priced, but I just didn't have a reason to wear it. I really want you guys to take note of how sometimes you will not find all the athleisure in the active wear section. You have to go looking for it sometimes. They might be in pants. They might be in women's wear. You never know when you're going to find a good pair of joggers. But as we continue to thumb through some of the stuff they have here, I really didn't see too much. I saw these pair of Adidas black sweats. They don't really stand out to me. Run the mill, but if you're looking to start a sweatpants collection, I guess it's a good start. I also stumbled upon a pair of nice Levi cargo joggers. They were cool. I really liked the color, but for $24, they were just a bit too expensive for me. But I could see how somebody could make this into a fit. Just not my vibe. Next, we stumble our way to the button-ups. I found this cool Paisley shirt. Wasn't really my vibe. I like looking through this section for quality work clothes, but you can sometimes find very cheap clothes that feel very soft and rippable. So really investigate the brands here, all right? Like I said, Cactus Man is definitely a good one to check out for. I really didn't have too much luck in this section. I stumbled upon this cool short sleeve button up. The floral pattern was very cool. It was also silky, very good material, but I was balling on a budget, so it wasn't really worth the cop, so I had to pass, but for what, $15, I think? Very good buy, y'all. I would highly recommend the cop. Not too much to report on in the sock department. I will say, Ross can give you a lot of quality brands like Polo Ralph Lauren. I see Adidas here all the time. And they even had a pair of Nike socks for once. All for the average price of about $10. You can't beat Ross socks, guys. Looking for something new? Shop in the sock section. And before we go, let's check out some of these ties. I really have fallen in love with ties lately. I don't know, I'm trying to do something different with my workwear and some of these ties just look so damn good. But the thing with me is once I fall in love with something, I will obsess over it. So if I get one tie, I'll probably go ahead and get five more later. And I just had to pass with the thing I got out of control. But as you can see, there are a lot of good options here, guys. So if you're looking to switch up your professional wear, Try some ties. You got floral patterns, you got purple, you got red. Staples like black and blue. I mean, this is a great place to start a tie collection. I really like it. So at the end of the day, I only walked away with two things, the Gap shirt and the Gap pants. But overall, I'm very satisfied with this Ross shopping experience. Ross will surprise you with some of the brands that you will find in there. You just gotta be willing to dig through the dirt to discover the treasure. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please leave a like subscribe and give me some feedback. 
I love shopping at Ross, Plato's, and other places, so I will continue to deliver content like this if it's something that helps you. I appreciate you guys, and I hope you have a great day. I'll catch you in the next video.